This place is probably safe. That th there's a guard thunderstorm outside that keeps all the the, the cretins out. Oh fuck! It's a bad start. 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 Can I come outside? It has ice powers. You don't need ice powers. You're a giant lion. Oh fuck! They hurt. Holy shit. <laughs> Looking forward to this fight. <laughs> oh, ice. Ice is a nightmare in this game. Dude, it flies at you from such a... <sighs> okay. It puts out a giant fucking white cloud in a white level, and that does damage over time. Like, not even over... This. It just actively beats the shit out of you. That was a lot of damage from, like, the remnants of a long... A cloud that had been sitting there for a while. I'm really bad at fighting the lions in this game. Ah, fuck. Uh. Ow. What a weirdly slow attack. Second one? Help. Let me out. A second one mid fight? Oh, it's half dead already. Did the first one heal? No. This one's just fucked up or something. Now it's above me. It's not interacting well with that ceiling. It's got glowy eyes. Oh my god! You think he was ready for me? I think he was ready for me. You think he, do you think he let me pet him? Maybe he let me pet him. Oh god, not both. This is really bad. <gasps> no! God, they were both like one hit from dying. I got a little too aggressive because I thought I could finish him off and also didn't expect the other guy to run over all of a sudden. He seemed to be really disinterested for the mo until that moment. Fuck, there's a whole second one. Dude, what is is he scripted to show up when the first one's about to die or did he patrol? Oh, he's just right here. That was just a giant horrible coincidence, I guess. First one coming. Yep. Ow. Ah, bad miss. That was, hey, that was a good turnaround. I didn't trust him to do that. Now. Oh god. Ah. They're dead. I killed them. I killed them with stabbing. Ah. Okay. I'm afraid to rest at the bonfire because I don't know if they respawn. They probably don't respawn because they dropped good stuff. Like three things. So they're probably permanently dead. But goddamn. I said shit goddamn.
Is there going to be an expansion to this game? They just so consistently have DLCs, I was going to say, until I just realized their most recent game didn't have a DLC. I don't think it did, did it? I don't remember there being a DLC for... Uh, Sekiro. But all three Dark Souls games... And then also... Uh, Bloodborne had one. Oh my god! I was a bit distracted with the wolves, but okay. Shit. Oh! Something like that. Ow! 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 What the fuck? What is that damage? Everything does so much damage in this game. Oh no. Oh my god. Oh my god, just fucking die! I hate birds! Ugh. They're so annoying to fight. Anything that's above you or flies is just a nightmare when you're using a melee weapon. Like, only one of them aggroed somehow. Oh, look at him. I wonder if they're recycled from Dark Souls 3? The Ashes DLC? The Painted Ashes? Is that something? <laughs> Ariandel? There we go. Because this is a huge game for them to make relatively quickly. Probably not that quickly, but you know, they're making other stuff in the meantime. I'm sure they have like different teams and everything, but still it's like, whoa. <laughs> It's not like it's not like From Software disappeared for six years and then suddenly put out Elden Ring. So when I look at the wolves, I'm like, hmm, I, are you a, are you a familiar monster? And I think it's been said that the Red Wolf is a Dark Souls three boss that they scrapped. So I wonder how often there are things that are recycled from old games or they're. Uh, things that they made for old games, but then didn't actually put in the game. Like how the, uh, the big hammer... The big hammer tree demon things are supposedly... I think they're supposed to be the Asylum Demon? Like the Asylum Demon, Asylum demon skeleton and animations mostly, but a new character model that is noticeably shaped like the Asylum Demon. The, ca the careful reuse and of assets is always an interesting thing, because starting completely from scratch is just such an ordeal. Uh oh. Oh, was it? Uh... Oh, fuck me. Oh, oh. These are like summons or something, or oh, they teleport. I forget how this works. I fought these before. I'm gonna run to that Grace I saw, because I'm about to have a I'd be out of heals, and I don't want to start over. Bye. I'm always interested, even though even if I don't fully understand what I'm he being told, I mean I'm always interested in hearing some of these things. Ah ah ah! Sit 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 out D out. I don't think I can do it. I don't think I can do it when he's right here. Ha 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 ha! Oh god! He teleported straight to me. Haha! -ha. I think there's like a distance thing where he's, he's too close, I can't do it, but you gotta get away. That guy just died right here! <laughs> that guy just died right here! Exactly like I was going to. Uh, what are we at? 88,000. But like, I, like, for example, World of Warcraft. They added the Volpera to the game. And... If I'm, in cor if I'm correct in what I've heard, the little foxes that you can play as, the Volpera, are repurposed goblins? Like their skeleton? That helps, the, that gives them a starting point that makes it much faster to make a new playable race. Especially a, a, a semi-obscure, like, unlockable one. Oh, great sun, frigid son of soul, surrender yourself to the eclipse, 
Grant life to the soulless bones. Eclipse shuttle. Shuttle? Shuttlecraft? <laughs> and for that matter... <clears throat> oh god. Whoa, where did you aggro from? These guys have long line of sight, apparently. Whoop! Wow, I didn't do that roll correctly, did I? What are you doing up there? <laughs> Buddy! Can't block this. Can't block this. Can't block this. <laughs> yeah, unblockable attack. And then his AI just doesn't adapt, I guess. Or, like you hear stuff about like the. Uh, th there's there's a lot to figure out. I, I'm not good at I'm not I'm not good at recognizing it because they do a good job. But oh fuck you. But I guess the monsters in Monster Hunter are recycled a lot from other monsters. And I don't mean the obvious ones like Viper Topokadachi being Topokadachi, but a different color with a new status effect. That's the really blatant ones that are that are like just a, a recolor variant. But like the extent to which like the various like fanged wyverns might have the same like stature and animations and movesets, but they're like they separate them enough visually that it becomes less obvious how much they have in common. Obviously, none of the monsters are like... I don't think they're usually ever direct copies of each other. That's a really big wolf! Hi. Uh-oh. <laughs> Uh-oh. He sounded the alarm. Now there's two really big wolves. The other one looks smaller, but it was just an optical illusion of distance! Oh, shit. Oh, God! I wasn't ready for that move to be like that. Well, now I am ready, so... Embarrassing for you. I remember it being like an almost embarrassingly long time before I kind of started to pick up on how similar Toba Kodachi... Ah. Oh, fuck. Wow. How similar Toba Kodachi and Odo Garon are. Besides being fanged wyverns, like, I think they're, like, really, really similar in a lot of other ways. I don't know. They, they're good They're good enough at the reuse of assets and stuff that they can, uh, make it harder to, uh... Hard for me to even pick up on this stuff. But that's game development. Like, I think there's a thing where, like, when World came out... There was, like, entire categories of monsters that were, like, noticeably absent in, like, the next-gen new game. Because they'd have to be, like, kind of re-implemented. And, like, that whole- the whole type of monster kind of would have to be re-implemented together. What's up? That's some weird- some weird walking you're doing there, bud. Anyway. That was some cryptid, I am not a wolf stuff going on. Badoop. What I find interesting is sometimes if you if you point out anything about the economics of how a game is developed and like these kind of details of like just kind of the, the shortcuts and tricks and whatnot, people get really defensive sometimes and like like you're attacking their franchise that they that they that they like and I'm like uh, I'm not sure how you missed the part where I like it, but okay. Like, no, it's just a basic rule of how some a lot of the stuff works, and it's just interesting to think about. But then again, we live in a world where there's people getting mad on Twitter because, like, the new God of War is going to re still be using the same getting in the boat animation from the old God of War. Like, they need to, like, reanimate from scratch. Dude pushes a boat into water and jumps into it. Like they can't can't bring that animation back. Like this idea that a, a AAA game that is already hilariously expensive to make needs to also like be completely recreated from scratch every sequel. Like we're a little too broken by certain games made by Ubisoft and whatnot being a little too recycled and a little too uh, paint by numbers and uninspired that like any slightly perceived pattern or cut corner cut is like you being directly ripped off it's like all right well there exists a a, a reasonable ground between these two extremes but okay <laughs> oh fuck 
Fuck you. Wow. Oh, God. It works like that. Also, that guy's throwing shit at me and he's like too good at it. Okay. Oh, jeez. Uh -huh. Serpentine, serpentine, serpentine. It doesn't work. It doesn't work. It doesn't work. All right, fuck this guy. Oh my god. <laughs> that siege weapon was a bad time. <laughs> uh, I hated that. All right, let's go this way. Uh, weird slugs? Cool, my people. Oh, fuck. I'm sorry, I didn't mean to respond like that. That was rude. I'm leaving though, bye. I just prefer clothed friends. No, not more birds. I don't like anything here. This place is really hostile. I know it's a Souls game, but like this is unusually oppressive. It's, start, it's starting to get to me. <clears throat> a decent number. I've, I've talked. I'm talking in like the the furry Monster Hunter Discord and stuff, and like <laughs> that's a sense. And like a lot of them beat this game a while ago now, and I remember a lot of them expressing fatigue and exhaustion by the end. And I can get. I get it. I'm imagining like, oh, they experienced just the overwhelming, just fuck you attitude of this of these places, but on a faster scale because they're playing the game faster than I was. And I'm like, yeah, I don't think those two, I don't think those things mix. All right, so I guess we're back at the beginning. So that ladder was, I guess that ladder is a shortcut I can take to get back to the siege weapon. Okay. <laughs> Why not? That makes it somewhat safer to approach that direction. And the lions are not back? Okay. Seems relatively likely I'll be playing a different character when I get back to Monster Hunter. Oh fuck, I dropped- I fell down a hole. No, it's a ladder. I can go back. When we get if I get back to Monster Hunter for the expansion, it seems likely I'll be playing a different character on PC. Boop. Just because I've been playing it lately in my free time. As that dude. Uh, shortcut for later? No. Yeah, I mean, yes. No, that I can't go that way. Yes, that it's exactly that. Please don't explode into horrible, deadly miasma. Yeah, I don't think there's anywhere else to go, right? Besides the direction past the other grace, which is the forward direction, most likely. Oh, right, you exist. Ah, I can't block this, though! God. I don't think I can dodge through this. It is a whole-ass flurry of attacks. That's not how iframes tend to do. Shit, ow. Oh yeah, this might help. A bit. Ugh! Oh, wait, did you shoot above me? Really? <laughs> really? 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 <laughs> Ow! Oh fuck, another one. Really? You can just duck under them? Uh, 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 okay. That was absurd. He, the AI got to experience the frustration that I feel whenever I attack a crystal lizard and my stupid fucking character won't attack down. Where did he go? Oh, hello. <laughs> Where the fuck were you? <laughs> I guess he's one of the teleporty guys, but that was a weird teleport 
dude, it's so frustrating whenever you want to hit a crystal lizard and he's right there and your character just won't attack right. And you're like, I'm locked on. What is lock on for if not this? Oh, please don't hit me. I'm so done with, with birds. Oh, hey, it's one of these. Dude, I, I always want to like get a get like a photo of these from here. A little bit m much on the work. Uh, was it Windows Shift S? Doop do. Doop. Doop. Ha 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 ha. Open up Paint. Someone was like, "Didn't they discontinue Windows Paint?" And I'm like, "I don't, I don't know." But I have it, so. I'm not, I'm not giving it back. <laughs> I'm not giving. You can't have it. It's mine. Uh, I don't know. It's just a quick built into the, built into Windows thing. I can paste pictures into. That I also have Earthen View, I guess. So it's like moon, graves, no pillars, broken pillars, and a tower. That might be identifiable. Yeah, I, I just... I don't... I've talked about it before. I just don't like the fact that when you look at it in your inventory, it's way smaller. And it's also a square now, instead of a rectangle. Like, instead of a, in being in portrait mode, it's fucking Instagram mode. Like, I don't... Why'd they do that? Is this the door I couldn't open earlier? Is that the ending of this whole storyline? That's the wolf and bird from earlier, maybe. Oh, hi! <laughs> <laughs> So I guess that's the entirety of that arc, is that you, it ends with a secret. I do want to find all of these, it's just... I don't know, I need free time. What's that like? I've been trying to rebuild my backlog ever since the Beastars schedule. So that I can have a, a couple weeks between when things get recorded and when they go up. Because that's that's how you make things consistent, without having to worry about... Uh, running out of time and other stuff. Schedule conflicts. Uh, no, I guess it was past here. No, thank you. But I've also had other goals. Like wanting to practice drawing. And also actually interacting with people on the Discord and so on. Which is counterproductive to all sorts of things, honestly. Ow! Aha! I don't have to activate it, so you can't catch me in time. And at some point, I gotta go write and record and edit and upload another video essay. <laughs> I can barely keep up with everything else. It's like, oh yeah, I remember your incredibly time-consuming hobby. <laughs> I guess I'm okay at it, judging by the response to the last video. Could be a job at some point. But that gets people scared. Because they're like, but let's place. Yeah? What's up, buddy? Buddy? Okay. Here we go. Huh! Oh! He nothing personal kitted me! Oh my god, it's so many sword swings. Fuck me. <laughs> Alright, well I'm taking a drink. Cause that's... I need to recover from that mess. Fly the no! Blah, 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 blah. I just downed an entire fucking coffee. 
a thing that's not entirely pleasant, but, you know, sometimes you gotta keep up with your recordings and you, the game doesn't have enough dialogue. <laughs> there are several blessings to games that have dialogue and cutscenes on a regular basis that are, well, that, that's voiced. Because <laughs> you're like, oh, not only do I not have to talk the entire time, so it takes a little bit of that, the weight off there. Pat. But also sometimes you get to stop there and, and eat or drink for a moment quietly. Which means you don't have to do it between episodes. But then you got Dark Souls games with their gameplay focused structure that I love. <laughs> Let's not mix things up. I love these games just the way they are. <laughs> it's just that as somebody who's also doing Let's Plays, I'm like, I don't know, I could use a few opportunities here and, here and there. This is the most NPCs with the most dialogue ever in any of their games by a margin, I believe, but still pretty sparse. Yeah, he definitely sees you instantly. Fuck. Oh, I did it again. I'm dying again. I'm dying again. I'm dying again. Same way. Okay. Fuck you, dude. Ow! <laughs> Remember when I got a bunch of new weapons so that I could replace these ones because like they maybe weren't gonna last in the long term against difficult enemies and then now I still switch to these. I still use these in most difficult situations anyway. The other weapons mostly just exist for when I really can't connect my hits against a boss because the hitboxes are fucky. Which makes me really think once again, you know, it's not really the weapon's fault, it's the design of the boss's fault, to be honest. It's one thing if the boss is like actually like a weird kind of like in the air boss or something like that. Or is on a, you know, horseback. I will never blame this game for not letting me connect hits very easily on horseback with this weapon. I, I obviously should use the scythe or something on a horseback. Or, you know, a spear, like people on horseback do. <laughs> like, that's on me when I try to make that square peg fit in that round hole. When I try to use the, the cypher pata on horseback. But when I'm fighting the tree demon thing... The, 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 the asylum demon tree guy? Or that one masked stone dragon guy or whatever? And I'm like right up in his shit, and I'm attacking, and none of my hits connect. You know, at some point, I think that's the game's fault. <laughs> and I don't think I'm being unreasonable there. I think it's a bit of a dick move. Well, you can't be permitted to live. Oh. There goes those platforms. Oh, there we go. Please don't drop an item. Ah, oh, fuck. <laughs> uh, I don't think I can get back if I jump that way. I think I'm just gonna have to live with that. There's definitely something screwy going on with the... Uh, it's a combination of hitboxes and how sometimes how lock-on works. So sometimes the lock-on is just relatively high on their butt. No, rats! They're weirdly dangerous! These used to scare the shit out of me in a... Uh, in Dark Souls 1. Ow. Because the upper undead burg is so dangerous and so difficult to get through when you're new at the game. A lot of people have the entire layout of that area scarred into their brain, as I as I showed when I drew that for the, the Let's Draw Dark uh, a game, Let's Draw Dark Souls series thing. Dr draw video games from memory. When I did Dark Souls, other people did other games. Andrew did Banjo-Kazooie, Mumbo Mountain. <clears throat> but a lot of people have that beginning of the game just... just... seared into their mind. <laughs> and so there's just various sparks like, oh, here's the firebomb guys, oh, here's... The, oh, the, the fucking rats! The rats are scary because they hit you and it builds up a little status meter and you're like, what? I've never seen that before. What does that mean? 
That's already concerning. And then it actually maxes out and you're like, Oh no! And you just get to watch as your characters- Oh, I did not- I shouldn't have done that. You get to just watch helplessly as your character's health continually drains and you don't probably have the tools to solve it. And you're like, fuck, 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 This is a new bed that I didn't know was on the table. But here it is. It's on the table now. Where am I going? Did I miss a path somewhere that I can still take? Wait, I don't think I ever went this way. I think I went around upstairs. Uh huh, item. Nope. Whoop. Ha, ah, ow. Oop, that's a bad idea. Bird bad, bird bad. Birds are bad. Every bird's bad. Nope. That's why my friend tries to catch him. Yep. Oh, that's more hits than expected. Definitely feels like they're trying to specifically deprogram the idea that you can just dodge stuff the way that the, that people have largely decoded the franchise as being more and more you have to deal with attacks. That, wait, didn't I go this way before? Why is there an item here? Oh, nope, I haven't been here. Uh, where did I go last time? Oh, fuck, he's still chasing me. Oh, fuck. Oh, fuck. Oh, fuck. Oh, fuck. Fuck, 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 fuck. Oh, hi, giant axe man. I'm the axe man, we ba 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 da ba. Oh, fuck you. Nope. Nope. Oh my god, no, not him. No. It's extremely personal, kid. Oh, shotgun. Huh? Gah! <laughs> Teleported onto the thing. No, 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 no. Commander Nial. Oh fuck. Oh fuck. Oh fuck. It's one of these. Oh fuck. These are these happen still. Uh. Uh. Oh fuck. He's summoning way worse things this time. Oh no. He summons nothing personal, kid. That this is really bad news. I didn't know he was about to do that. I don't think that Mimic Tear is gonna let live. <laughs> what? How the hell did that miss? Actually, he's he's winning, isn't he? Maybe not all the way. Oh God, that's a slow attack. Hey, Mimic, Mimic Tear's alive. Oh, uh, he's dead. Damn it! I wanted to heal him, but I had had to find my healing spell because I don't I don't act like a cleric often enough. All right, well this is a bad attempt, but you know I didn't know what I was walking into. Mimic Tear is definitely a better ally for this kind of fight than the wolves were. What? Stop exploding, dick! Phrasing. Okay, bad miss. What? Oh, he does stuff like that now, huh? Oh my god, he exp- mm. I'm getting really tired of the exploding enemies. Where was the shortcut? Uh, I remember finding the shortcut... Uh... Elevator, but I don't remember where it was. But I just- I don't like that enemies keep exploding in this game. It just seems like a dick move. Just a massive A. What happened to when there was like a giant build up to the AoE? Like, oh man, here it comes. I'm charging my lip. Ow, fuck. There was a whole style of charge up attack, and you learn and you would learn to recognize it from game from enemy to enemy because it had a look to it. Is just running through here the fastest way, I guess? Oh fuck. But all these guys are here. Yep. They shouldn't be able to catch me. Okay. Like, that guy- Like, it's one thing that his, his- Some of his other stuff are explosions. But it's an explosion when he does, like, the fucking... Hang on. Gotta get prepped. Ah! 
Ow. Oh, he's not that strong. There we go. But like, even, like, the previous Com Commander O'Neill had attacks that were, like, reasonable to avoid. Explosions. But, like, that little stomp he does doesn't have that much of a buildup. How do you know he's gonna do it? Oh my god, that's big. It looks like it's bigger than it is, too. Because I'm surprised it wasn't hitting me. I don't think that works. That heal didn't do shit. I think he just has too much health for me to reasonably heal. Ow. Yeah, like, that attack is an explosion where he just- he taps his heal. How is that- why is that fair that that's an explosion? I should grab this stuff before I die. No, not a critical. Damn it. I don't want criticals. I'm not here for that moist lifestyle. Oh fuck. Oh fuck. Oh fuck. Double heal, double heal. He's gonna give me frostbite. Oh, what the fuck? This, he's got a lot more moveset than the last one did. Okay, yeah, that's an opening. Get it, get it, get it, get it, get it. Yeah. Veteran's prosthesis. That seems mean. <laughs> That's a mean thing to take. <laughs> I just took that guy's prosthetic. I'm Rocket Raccoon. Rocket Raccoon. Something, something. Gidgeon's Bible. <laughs> My encyclopedic Beatles knowledge is something to be reckoned with. <laughs> How am I doing on... wait. Have I remembered to... Yeah, there's no... okay, there's no seeds here. Okie dokie. Oh, we got through it. Yeah, so I, I just basically just need to focus his ads down first. As opposed to letting my, my buddy distra distract them. Because my buddy is more helpful if he distracts the actual boss. And uh, they went... That, the freaking Two Swords guy died way faster. He was definitely weaker than the one outside. I think it's Rocky Raccoon in that song. I always wonder if one of them's related to the other one somehow. Just because it seems o o oddly specific, but it could just be a fun alliterative name for a raccoon. Unlike, unlike Toaster. Who would name a raccoon Toaster? Hi? Well, I need that, don't I? Lord Michaela, forgive me. The sun has not been swallowed. Our prayers were lacking. Your comrade remains soulless. I will never set my eyes upon it now. Your divine halic tree. Hmm. On some level, this kind of, this game kind of does the, the the vague like Zelda e thing where it's like you play Ocarina of Time and it's like oh, you get you get the, the the charms, the rocks, the special gems to take them to the temple, and then you then this then the, the midway point plot point happens, and now it's like now here's the new thing to search for. The Triforce is usually the second half of the game's MacGuffin thing. Uh. So this is like, sort of like, a big goal, and then it's like, oh, here's the new goal, and so on. This game keeps hinting at stuff, 
The problem is I don't have the context for it or know what they're talking about. What did they try to jump to? <laughs> I, just, I just saw the thing up here. Uh, this is an environmental storytelling right here. Look at this. Oh, hey, Graves. Have I been there yet? This is environmental storytelling. There's a single note up on a ledge and then a ton of, of blood stains because of all the people that tried to get to that note. Let's make a mistake. Oh, there it goes. I'm like, I'm smarter than all these people. I'll just jump on this piece of wall. Oh, there he goes. He's he's going. <laughs> he's still going. Oh, I meant to land on like the little piece of debris. But instead I made a fool of myself. It's back did I, did I send it back down reflexively? Probably. I guess he was always glowing that much. I thought that was my remains for a second there. I'm like, I'm like, why is it that far back? All right. But yeah, you keep hearing about the air tree and the runes, and there's Mika this Michaela thing, and Radon Festival. And, uh, the capital, and so on and so forth. And there's enough of those that you start to wonder, like, which one of them might be even your goal at the end. And it might have been mentioned at the very, very beginning, but, like, it's one of those things where, like, the, consist the story is not consistently there enough to keep track of your overall goal. Because you don't really have a consistent cast, or even consistent narrative, to, like reinforce what's happening and keep it fresh. You talk to like one guy every two hours and he's up and he's doing his own thing unrelated to what you're up to most of the time. So good luck remembering. I right, so we're up here. So I was heading south down here before, earlier but I went and got curious about this whole direction. Wow, yeah, this was its own whole tangent, huh? I was trying to figure out how to go downhill over here to fill in the map. Probably because that feels like the ending, maybe? Maybe not the ending. Because they keep talking about the Hallowed Tree now. But I think this is the place where you burn your Firekeeper to recycle the naming scheme go west because uh, she's she's like our fire keeper of this game but she's not because that's not what these games are but you know what I mean unless you don't because a lot of you started for this a lot of for a lot of you this is your first from software game in which case I've been like casually throwing spoilers around or whatever but I don't know it's I think it's reasonable to have the implication that you're playing these games in order they are not obscure games the from the Dark Souls games are relatively popular and as somebody who covered them all, it'd be weird to, to like, tiptoe around the games that I have a lot of history of covering. There's a lot of items hiding, hanging around here. I didn't, I guess, I, yeah, I didn't have time to look around. Because bad news was spawning at me constantly. Oh, they're back! Oh! I didn't think they'd be back? Considering the stuff. Uh, how do I get down? I already went through most of those directions, right? It's like an outer border. Oh, there's the wind. That's how I got up here. 
Is this a whole direction? I'm just trying to get... I'm trying to go down the waterfall if possible. Check out the whole western chunk of this area. Because, yeah, I, f I feel like the fire is the end of this zone. Because they introduce at the beginning the goal of burning your fire keeper. Oh, hey. Or yourself. But the Halog Tree stuff hasn't happened yet. And we just got the beginning of your... We got half of the thing that lets you go there. Is someone there? A customer? Well, how long has it been? The Vagabond Set. Missionary's Cookbook. Look how cheap these are getting compared to my actual money now. Actually, not that cheap. It's, this is 15 grand to get three swords. You know, I think that there's been a bit of inflation there. Um. Um, 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 um. Uh, I forgot. 8k, shit. I immediately forgot how much they cost. Oops. I did the calculations, but boy am I bad at math. Alright. Yeah, generally speaking, I want to grab all of their rune arcs and stone swords and cookbooks. So I don't have to come back. Because I won't. <laughs> I won't remember which ones I left them at. And you might need those in the future. Do I have that one? I do. I can teleport right down there right now if I wanted to. I'm all the way back here. Uh. Doggy. But from here it's easier to jump towards the wind, I believe. But that was a good find. Now let's see if we can take things lower. Uh, uh, I'm okay. Oh, me of little faith. It's a uh, long way down. It's been a long December. There's reason to believe. Maybe this one will be better than the last. Uh, not loving my chances. How the fuck do you get down there? Uh, I, I just imagined it. Huh. Huh. Huh, 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 huh. Head back down towards... Uh, five? Maybe I have to finish this half of the zone first or something. I don't know. There might be a lift that goes there. All I know is I have no idea how to get there and that cliff looks... Uh, prohibitively garganch. So I don't think I'm gonna put a ton of faith in that one. Oh, the scary dogs are back and the scary birds are back. I'm hearing stomping. Oh, hands. Things are getting a little caleb -y around here, aren't they? It's giants versus birds versus hands. The natural ecosystem. The proper way of things. Yep, they have a decent amount of health. The smoldering butterflies being consistently associated with, like, the lava guys is interesting. What's the, uh, I can't check my map to see if I if I recognize that spot on the map where that statue is. Oh, there's a hand. Nope. 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 
Nope. Nope. Oh, I'm being evaded. It's always what that means. Uh, bloody finger, Okina. Ah. Uh. Eh. What? Wow! Ow. Nope. Oh, thought he was gonna keep closing that gap. Ow. It's over, Anakin. I have the high ground. Alright, nope. Aha! Weren't expecting me to hit you with my weapon. Ow. Ow, oh, shit. Range. Bummer. I'm gonna get hit by a sword. Psych. Ow! Jeez! It's mostly surprise where I just 100% do not expect them to connect some- Like, they're so far away sometimes, I just can't accept that they hit me. Whoa! Okay, he had a secret I win button he was just waiting to use, I guess. What the fuck? That was, uh, rude. Man, he was one hit from death. That's a dickish move to just have. Ah, you mean I can't just get loot for free with no conflict or struggle? This is an infringement on my rights as a gamer. Am I still being chased? Ah, oh, they—they're all picking on that guy now. Have fun, y'all. attack did he barely start doing that did that much damage? <laughs> ah! It's more hits than I thought. Too many hits. Stop it. <laughs> it's too many hits. <laughs> I need you to chill. Rivers of blood. It's probably at least, it's at best one river of blood. It's a sword. Let's not get too hype now. Okay, that hurt. Ow. You watched me cut road like a beast in repose. Uh, there we go, flasks. 
increase the amount of char. Oop. Boom. Definitely a slower, more cumulative effect that's harder to appreciate. You're like, eventually my healing's getting better, I swear. But it still always feels like it heals like less than half of my health bar. See, I do I get a decent number of double chugs whenever I, I have uh, some damage taken. Which makes my 12 flasks feel more like a 6. At times. What? Oh yeah, there's their tree. Isn't that the one though? Like the big one? I don't think I need to discover that one. Trolls roar. I think I can figure out that one and what that one's like from context. Veteran's prosthesis. Bladed prosthetic leg and wreathed with the power of lightning instead of instead of instead attached to the fist. Uh, Commander Nial, veteran of Castle Soul, offered this prosthesis in exchange for the lives of defeated knights held prisoner. He went on to lead the men, these men as an army of no nation. Rivers of Blood. Weapon of Okina, swordsman from the land of reeds. A cursed weapon that has, be that has felled countless men. When Moog, Lord of Blood, first felt Okina's sword and madness upon his flesh, he had a proposal to offer Okina the life of a demon whose thirst would never go unsated. Well, it's pretty sated now. Because he's dead. 